Well, good morning. Very nice little treat for you today. It's a Mercedes-Benz C250 CDI Blue Tech or Blue Efficiency. I'll forgive my ignorance. It is a 2012 and it is absolutely as new. This is part of the W204 series. They might call it a C204. Uh, first introduced this platform in 2007. And then uh, the, the sedan was so good looking in uh, end of 2010, Mercedes decided to release a coupe. And um, you know we're all glad that they did because just take a look at this thing. It's absolutely awesome. You know, it's reminiscent of the larger Mercedes coupes, but without that huge price tag. We've got a 2.1 litre twin turbo and it absolutely flies, but you've got, you know, a combined fuel cycle of just around a little over six around town and out on the highway, you'll break this thing into the fours. It is that good. The cars come to us from Canberra, which is another bonus. No salt or city dings. And uh, you know, it really shows. There's not a mark on this thing. It, it really, it really looks the part. Delivered new to Mercedes-Benz in Canberra. We've got a very workable boot for a coupe. Space saver spare and a very new battery under there. Very fresh. Bright white is just, uh, with the black interior and the dark legal tint, it is just stunning. We've even got this panoramic style glass roof that, that looks great. Opening up the, the car, we've got black leather sports buckets, heavy duty bolstering, and it actually can take four passengers. You know, you've got two seats back there, uh, I hope you can see in the light. For the kids, you know, if they complain, just tell them to be happy. <laughs> or you've got some grumpy adults back there for a short sojourn. But it's all about the front seats on this very special car. Brushed aluminium trim everywhere, feels great. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm still getting all the new car vibes from this car, the smell, the condition. It wouldn't look out of place on a Benz showroom. Daytime LED running lights and that very aggressive grill. Almost looks a little bit like its AMG counterpart. You know, but you're gonna have 75% of the performance of that car without anything close to the fuel consumption. Sitting in, you can see we've done just 35,000 Ks, 35,235. So it's, it, you know, it's as close to new as you could hope. Gonna fire it up. Always remember on a diesel to let your glow plugs warm up before you turn the ignition. Fires right to life, very quiet. I've got the wonderful Mercedes-Benz Command Linguatronic navigation MMI system. We've got that coupled to the Harman Kardon Logic 7 surround sound stereo, which sounds amazing. We'll see if we can give you a little try out of that. Bear with me. Audio, now. Radio. It takes you a little while to figure out this system. It is the update and I'm more experienced with the older ones. So you can connect your iPod as well. You've got auxiliary input. Um, I'm not sure where it is but you've got a little SD card reader down there. That's the little toggle switch you use to control all the functions on the screen like Navi, go back to telephone and so on and so forth cup holders 
auto dimming mirror, illuminated vanity mirrors of course, and just a wonderful seating position, very sporty, sports bolstered steering wheel with uh, multimedia controls. I've even got paddle shifters on the back here. And you have to consider, considering how new this car is, and the massive saving over original sticker price, there's not a lot you can buy that's as nice as this. I mean, you could go out and buy a, a new Honda Accord or a Mazda or something, but um, why would you? Honestly, just look at this car. It's gorgeous. Nice master keys. As I mentioned, daytime running LEDs. It's uh, got enough LEDs up there to look like the front of the Starship Enterprise. All the safety you'd expect from a very current Benz. Excellent Pirelli P0 tires. No scuffs on the wheels either. If you're after a, one of the most gorgeous coupes in this price point, you can't go past this car. Give us a call, send us an email. We're the old timer sender, www.old.com.au. We'd very much like to hear from you. We'll catch you down the road.